I, I'd spoken to Abe Kawa back in December, and he had a lot to say in that conversation. But one thing that really stood out was his thoughts on how you had been approaching the fight game at that time. And he said he legitimately felt bad for the next person you'd be fighting because of what your mindset had become. Coming out of the fight with Kamara Usman, do you remember the moment where that switch flipped for you? I mean, the switch didn't switch instantly. You know, it took months. You know, I went into a state of depression for a while. You know, I really wasn't talking to a lot of people. I was really terrible. I wasn't training. And I really just didn't ex- did not expect. I felt like all my competition that I had before Kamara Usman, I felt like that was the stiffest competition. I felt like all the great welterweights I beat before then were going to be my toughest competition. I didn't take anyone lightly. And I didn't think it was going to be on cruise control at that point, but I felt like I had that five round mapped out so well. I felt like my strategy, my game plan, my studying, my coaches, my team. I felt like I had everything in position to win. So I really had to deal with that. And it took took longer than any other fight in my career. And um, I got to the point where, you know, I felt like I faced it head on. I felt like I'm a better person. I'm a better fighter. I'm a better human being because of it. And I felt like it was necessary for my journey. Sometimes you see guys... And they just go from the bottom to the top and they spread all the way through. And, you know, they got everybody helping them out, with whether it's media push or social media. And they just got all the things given. And it's the people that have to bounce back and have to face adversity and have to really show the fans what they're made of, that they're not going to just crawl up in a ball. And, you know, I'm coming out swinging. And I've always came out swinging in the key. But this time it's a little bit different because I plan on making this a complete lifestyle change the way that I'm taking up. The fight game and really my focus is really set back to that amateur Tyron Woodley that was trying to turn professional, that wanted to fight in the UFC, that wanted to be a champion, that wanted to reign, that wanted to be the greatest. And now I'm, I'm out for everything right now. 